Hello there, everybody. Okay, so I want to talk to you guys about um, using multiple inboxes here. So we have a email server here that um, we can whip up new domains and email addresses really quickly. So you guys can see here that I've created a bunch for all of you. Um, I'm going to put each of these in a folder corresponding to that person's addresses. Now, to talk about why this is super, super important, right? We are about to start sending follow-up emails to everybody that we leave voicemails with and uh, with everybody that we connect with on the phone that we do not book a meeting with. So that's a high volume of emails, okay? So if we want to have good email health, right, and get into as many inboxes as possible, we do not want to use the Easy Press AI domain. We want to spread the wealth, and luckily enough for us in Apollo, you have five mailbox slots for each user, okay? So what I'm going to ask you guys to do is find the folder that has your emails uh, in it, right? And I'm going to ask you to do exactly this task, okay? So we're going to come over here, and let's just say we're looking at Ethan's here, right? So these are SMTP and IMAP credentials, okay? These are how we're going to link our mailbox. So it's a little bit different than the uh, Gmail connection here. Um, but we're going to go ahead and just select Ethan at easypressexpress.com. So I'm going to go ahead and just copy that super quick. I'm then going to come over here and enter that. I'm going to agree, and then I'm going to link this mailbox. Now they're going to ask me, what's the IMAP and SMTP uh, configuration instructions? And I'm going to tell them, okay, so we're going to come here to select your email provider. Um, let me just make sure that MailReef isn't here. It is not, okay. And we're going to use a custom IMAP setting, okay. So Ethan at EasyPressExpress.com. Very good. I'm then going to come over to our password. And this is what we've got. Good. Just want to confirm that matches. Cool. So we're going to copy that, and we are going to paste it. Apologies, everybody. Uh, where am I here? There we go. Sorry. Paste that in there. Okay. Now the IMAP host is going to be right here. Cool. That port should be 993. Apologies. That's the SMTP host there. And our port there is actually going to be 465. Alrighty then. And then we're going to find the IMAP. And we see our IMAP host is right here. And our port is going to be 993. So we should be able to log in from here. And I'm going to ask you to do this uh, for all four additional mailboxes that I set up for you guys, okay? So this will all be in a folder, nice and organized for you, but you can see that we have a connected email now. Now, the reason why this is so important is we're about to hit a lot of volume here, even in, a, even in the follow-ups and in the voicemails. So we have to spread the wealth so that Google, Outlook, and Yahoo don't say, hey, this is a spam uh, sending machine, okay? We want to stay uh, below the radar there. All of your follow-up emails will be automatically rotated for you, so you don't have to configure any of that, all right? As long as we get these mailboxes in, again, everybody's going to get four. Follow the steps that I just completed there, and uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.